Okay, so I've got a really important, really deep, and a really powerful question I want you to consider. Are you doing life by design, or are you doing life by default? Now here's what I mean. Life by design means that you're in control of your life. Your life is based on your vision, your mission, and your values. Life by default, on the contrary, means that you're following somebody else's rules, somebody else's plans for your life, somebody else's beliefs about what you should or should not be doing with the most important asset you have, your life. So today, I want you to consider just for a moment what it takes to take true control of your future and start living a life by design instead of life by default. And one way, the fastest way that I know to start living your life by design is to focus on what I call the four freedoms in your life. Now, some of you have heard of some of these freedoms before, but if you've never put them all together, I'd ask you, are you truly free? So let's take a look at each of these and let's break it down. The first one I want you to consider is whether you have location freedom. Location freedom allows you to do whatever you want from anywhere in the world. I want you to imagine for a moment that you have what some people call the laptop lifestyle. Instead of being stuck in a cubicle, instead of some boss hovering over you, imagine that you have the ability to run your business from the Eiffel Tower, or maybe the Great Wall of China, or maybe you want to surf down in Australia. I don't know what your dreams are, I don't know what your passions are, but I want you to imagine for a moment with today's day and age and today's technology, you have the ability to do life from anywhere in the world. You can manage your finances, you can run your business, you can connect with people in your social network. You literally have the ability to travel to any place in the world and do whatever it is that excites you, whatever it is that inspires you, and whatever it is that feeds your soul. So the first thing I want you to do is to really think about what your life is gonna be like when you have true location freedom. Now I've had location freedom for close to 20 years. Even even while building businesses that we scaled from a handful of employees to over a thousand employees, I still maintain the ability to run my businesses from anywhere in the world and I want to inspire and encourage you to do the same thing. So set your goal right now to have, number one, location freedom. The next freedom is time freedom. And a lot of people don't realize that your number one asset in life is your time. So I want you to imagine now that you run your schedule that you have the ability to actually enjoy your time on the clock and your time off the clock, or what I call time in the game and time on the sidelines of the game. I can tell you there's plenty of people who when they come home after a long day of work, don't even have the time to relax then, much less the time to go to a movie in the middle of the day or the time to have lunch with a friend or the time to do some special thing for somebody that you love at 9 a.m. in the morning and take the whole day off and play. So I want you to imagine that the goal isn't to work longer until you retire. The goal is actually to retire sooner so you have more life to live. The next freedom that I want you to focus on is your financial freedom. I want you to imagine for a moment that you have everything in place to have zero worries about money. As a matter of fact, we're gonna move beyond worrying about money into a concept of freedom. Now, freedom doesn't mean escaping the reality of money. It means actually being fully engaged. It means being able to retire earlier rather than later. It means having reserves. So you can do not only what you need to do, but what you truly want to do in life. It means that you've been able to save. You're capable of operating with a budget. It means you've got the proper plan in place for your financial freedom, for taxes, and for creating a life of true abundance. What it doesn't mean is, is that you're gonna continue to raise your expenses to the point where you are working just for the things you own. I want you to imagine and set a goal now that you could truly be financially free in three years or less, that you can have passive income that exceeds your monthly expenses, and you can do it while having the time of your life. So the third freedom is financial freedom. The fourth and final freedom that I really want you to consider is called inner freedom. Now, I've traveled the world and I've been able to meet some really amazing people and some truly financially successful people. I've met people that are multimillionaires all the way up to billionaires. And here's what I can tell you. Some of those people have never achieved inner freedom. They've achieved financial freedom, they have location freedom, and some of them have time freedom. But unless you're doing more of what you love, less of what you tolerate, and none of what you hate, 
You're not truly doing life by design. It also means that you've handled your negative mental and emotional hang-ups from the past. So ask yourself this really true question. Ask yourself, if you were to run into an old boyfriend or old girlfriend or an old business partner or somebody that at one point in your life you had disagreements with, would you truly be clean? Have you handled your commitments from the past? Do you owe anyone anything? Do you need to clean up some of your past? Or do you have thoughts in your present day that keep reminding you of something you haven't handled in your past? You see, inner freedom goes beyond success and it goes into fulfillment. It means that you're clean and clear from your past and you're capable of investing your time in the present. Now to become completely transparent and completely authentic, this is an area that I'm still working on. There are often times that I'll go to bed at night and a thought or an idea will wake me up in the middle of the night and I'll go, oh my gosh, I forgot to handle that. Or I'll have an old memory from the past, something that in a family member isn't quite 100%. And I've done years and years in work of cleaning some of these things up, but they show up. As you do life, some of these things are going to continue to show up in your life. It's a constant process, and I want to encourage you to have not just one of the freedoms, not just time freedom, or not just location freedom, and not even just financial freedom, but I really, really, really want you to set your goals that in the next three to five years, you've been able to achieve the ultimate freedom all four freedoms. So take a moment right now and whether you journal or you just want to type some notes below, start to share with us what it's going to look like when you have all four of the freedoms. The moment you fall in love with this idea, your path has just begun. I'll look forward to connecting with you in the future. This is Jim Bunch saying until we connect again, have fun and remember it's your choice to create your ultimate life.